somebody was walking past the window, you know I'd be. Who that? Who that? Who that? Hey you guys, welcome back to our channel, the Soren Seward family. One thing I always try to do is I try to encourage people to don't look at me and think that everything is together because it's not. Don't like we doing everyday life just like you guys. Welcome back to our channel, the Soren Seward family. If you're new here, I'm Ivy. Go ahead and smash that subscribe button and ring that notification bell so you can be notified whenever we upload a video. Thank you so much for stopping by. And for all you returning subbies, hey family, how y'all doing? Y'all, today the twins have doctor's appointments. Doctor's appointments, yes. So I want to take you guys with me while I go and get them ready. My mom's in there having breakfast. I just finished getting myself together. I still have to get them together. And I got my coffee over here. Somebody was walking past the window. You know, I'd be. Who that? Who that? Who that? Um, y'all know I got my mug. I think that's my favorite mug. Like, I use this one so much. I use this mug all the time. Um, and I just like it because you guys know I like coffee and I like makeup. But if you guys are interested in getting you a mug or just seeing what it's about, go ahead and check this out. Be sure to check out Seward Creations at EtsyShop.com where you can get customized moment mugs and moment mugs designed by the Soren Seward family. We look forward to sending you your very own moment mug. And remember, all you need is a moment. All right. So how have you guys been? So much has been going on with us over on this side. Lately, I feel like my anxiety has been like roaring. Like last night, I literally had to get on my knees and was like, you know what, God, I need you to take control. Because so many times we often can let our things that we can't control take over our minds. And it seems like when I'm ready to go to sleep, everything just starts running through my mind. I'm like, uh-uh. Not today, let it go, leave it alone. And I know I'm not the only one because I see too many posts about it and too many people be up at the same time that I'm up just scrolling and posting and liking. So, I feel like the when, the things that you don't think about during the day, as soon as you start to go to sleep, they start coming. Like things you, they thought, things you ain't even thought of in years, okay? So last night I was like, God, take this from me because I, uh-uh, no, I want to go to sleep. And I did, I went to sleep. Uh-huh, it was some good sleep too. I woke up like this. Mm, well, not look. Anyways, um, I gotta go get the kids and get them together and we gotta go to this appointment. Yeah. I'm not saying that I miss working. Sometimes I do. I miss the adult conversations and just, you know, some friends. 
But um, I love being a stay-at-home mom. The caretaker is hard, um, I must say that. But if I had to choose between working and doing this, I would choose this. Uh, even though I don't get any lunch breaks where I get to enjoy a meal by myself, um, it's no set day. Like, I can't just go in there, organize my emails, get the drivers out, do all this stuff, and it's planned, or I can plan for it the next day. Um, it's none of that. It's like I can wake up and I have the kids sick over here. My mom needs to go to the emergency room. My mom got doctors and nurses and people coming in and out of the house because I finally got approved for having outside help come in to help my mom. So that was a big relief. Um, and it's a lot of things where I don't want to get into like complaining, but just know that everybody's journey is different. And what might be easy for somebody else is not the case for someone else. Everybody has their own journey. Whether you have kids, whether you don't have kids, whether you're a stay-at-home mom, whether you're a working mom, whether you're a single mom, whether you're a married mom, everybody's journey is different. And I want to encourage you to stay with it, to be encouraged. And trust me, the grass is not greener on the other side. Everyone has a certain struggle or something that they're dealing with in their life, you know. Um, I know we get caught up on social media and do it for the gram, do it for the gram. And one thing I always try to do is I try to encourage people to don't look at me and think that everything is together because it's not. Don't. Like, we doing everyday life just like we got. Now I got to go do the twins hair and we got to get out of here. Ooh, you get to call loud in here. <laughs> okay, never mind. All right, Hannah. Hannah, you're first. Come get your hair done, baby. Oh, first let me lotion up your, um, your legs and stuff so you can, um, yeah. Cause I had to, I'll be right back, you guys. I really didn't even do the hair. Like, I like smoothed it back a little bit and I put some headbands on. I put some headbands on them. Cause we got to, we gotta go. You guys, come on, come on, come on, come on. Let's go. Let's go, come on. No, you're not taking Dancy's iPad out the house. Get your shoes. Yes? What do you need from the store, Dot? Some avocados? Yeah. Yes, you can bring your book. All right, you guys, let me um get their shoes on. And, you're welcome. Let me get their shoes on and get them ready to get in the car. Can I some. The no, you're not wearing the light-up shoes. Get the shoes that I told you. You guys, huh? What do you say? Yeah, can you, pick the, can you pick that up right there, please? Thank you. Yeah. We will. Okay, you guys, so we are in the car and we are headed to the doctor's office. <clears throat> but the weather is it's humid, it's like 71. The weather's humid, I got my jacket just in case, but we should be fine since we're going indoors, so. Indoors? Yeah, like we're not going to like stay outside or anything like that. So I will see you guys when we get to the doctor, okay? What? You, <laughs> mommy! Every, everybody, not, we gotta get out. That is a starfish, babe, but that's not a starfish. That's just a star. It just has sparkles on it. Mm -hmm. it's Can you stop doing that with your nose? We gotta go. Okay. <laughs> Let's go. Yes, you can bring your book. You're welcome, baby. Let's go. No, no, it's at home. Okay, and you can't look anywhere else, just at the camera, okay? She's gonna check your eyes to make sure that your eyes work, all right? Okay. Okay, she's gonna check your vision, okay? So when she does the test, you have to look right at her, okay? Okay. Good 
We're gonna kiss it with your legs coming out this way for me. Good job. Alright. Okay, so they're rushing me. Well, the twins are not the people. These appointments went amazing. I think I do. I take these. Yes, I take these. They did really, really good. So we gotta go. That is the beach. Good job. That's the beach. Calm down, girls. I think I'm going to take them home. Yeah, and get them some lunch. And I still want to. Um, work on some stuff that I have going on so I appreciate you guys coming along hold on we always enjoy you guys told us and their doctor appointment was so good um they did have to get a shot in their finger to check their iron their iron came back really good everything was fine their growth is fine um Super, super proud of them, and it feels good. She checked Hannah's ear. Hannah didn't complain about her ear. Nothing was wrong with um, nothing was wrong with Hannah's ear. So thank God for that. Huh? I can't look. I'm driving. Your books? I see it, but I'm driving, baby. I can't look. Going to the doctor's office with them. I don't know how this video came out. Or I don't know how this video is gonna come out or how it's gonna look. But we're not piecing out yet. But it is not easy taking them to the doctor because one always be going one way, the other one's going another way. And they had to do these eye tests, right? And it's pretty good, it's pretty like good and cool how they did the eye test. But y'all, oh wow. She had to do it like four times and then it wasn't picking up so she had to go get a new machine. And then she had to come back and then she had to do it with the lights off and it ended up working. But trying to get the twins to not look at me as if we're taking a picture. And I'm vlogging at the same time, so they're like trying to look at which which one to look at, you know. Uh, was pretty funny, but it still took some, it still took some time. Um, yeah. Oh, yep, and I could get out, I could get out. What, what, bruh, bruh, go, bruh, go, bruh. All right, so <laughs> with all of this being said, um, thank you so much for, huh? It's fine. I mean, my, I have oily skin, y'all. I have oily skin, so the summertime, it be like, girl, it's a wrap. It's done. It's over. So, you guys, until next time, stay blessed, stay true, and continue to be you because the world needs more people like who? Like you. And if you're not feeling needed, remember here on the Soaring Sea with Family channel, you are needed. Guys, we are moving. You are needed. Y'all guys, say peace out. Peace out. And We'll see you on our next vlog. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and leave a comment down below and say hello. hello. Peace out. Hello, bye bye. Press down below. Press down below. Bye. You heard it here first. Bye.